our kingdom has existed for more than five centuries in peace and prosperity, but we have always been vigilant. The Fatimids in the north are upstarts, nothing but the newest Muslim family to tear its court apart before fading into the sands of time. All the while they prance and preen with the confidence and grandeur of the once mighty Romans. Ha! Their decadence knows no bounds. And it is the pride in this decadence that has addled their brains. Addled them enough to make demands of even me, the king of Mercuria. Georgios, my grand archbishop, has foreseen a great battle. A battle in the sands underneath those ancient pyramids that those upstarts have no claim to. It is Georgios' vision that has convinced me that almighty God himself wants these lands to return to our true Christian hands. So gather the men, bring up the elephants, saddle the horses, for we are going to meet their demands. Meet them with Mercurian steel. Hi guys and welcome to this glorious battle of the pyramids between the Mercurian Kingdom and the Fatimid Caliphate in the 1100 AD mod. Now I wanted to play this mod because it doesn't really get that much love on YouTube. Not that many people have made videos on it and it's a fantastic mod and it looks amazing as you can see. It just doesn't get the same coverage as some of the other Rome 2 mods get. So I wanted to uh, do a little bit of a massive battle for you guys here. A fantastic battle with the pyramids in the distance as the sandstorm whirls around us. Now, I hope you enjoyed the intro, guys. Please let me know whether you think that's a good idea or not to keep continuing doing it or not. I do have some other videos coming out with those types of intros, so let me know whether you enjoy this format. But first things first, guys, let's press play and have a look at some of our glorious units. So the Mercurians, they have... Four units of the Nubian Palace Guard, a very elite unit, including a general. Four units of the Axe Warriors, the Medium Axe Warriors, the boys. But three units of the glorious African War Elephant. Sorry, one of these is the general. It's this guy here. Glorious African War Elephants, the African Elephants, and some more African War Elephants ready to go. As well as some glorious cavalry. Some de armored desert cavalry, these desert boyos. And finally, some desert cavalry over this side as well. Now let's look at the Fatimids, the glorious Fatimids, defending their homeland from the Mercurians right now. They have some Arabian camel spearmen, medium melee cavalry, good against horses of course. In the front line, they have some nafta throwers, as well as some light archers. Behind them, Saracen heavy spearmen. And along the back, we have some heavy infantry as well as Fatimid long axes. Look at these guys. Very scary, very scary unit. Armor piercing unit. And the Fatimid heavy infantry as well. Very scary unit. Going to be boiling in the desert in those suits, but they've got a job to do. Then we have the Royal Fatimid Cavalry looking absolutely stunning over here. Ready to go as the general. Fatimid Light Cavalry, which is kind of a uh, um, missile cavalry, which we have a couple of units of those. And the Ascari Nobles. Very noble, very strong cavalry unit. Without further ado, guys, let's get this go let's get this battle going. Of course, they have more camel archers over here. And we shall see how this battle goes. The glorious Mercurians going full charge ahead, full steam ahead to engage the Egyptian Caliphate. With the elephants and the cavalry on the flanks waiting and watching. But you can see a huge cavalry move here along this side by the Fatimid Caliphate. As we engage the Fatimids with the desert cavalry. Very cool indeed. And you can see this... Uh, Camel archers coming round. Oh yeah, they have camel archers as well, the Fatimids. Ready to go. And the Ascari warriors fighting amongst the enemy. Very, very nice to see. Fantastic to see. Brutal fighting going on. You can see the Ascari nobles taking on our desert cavalry here. Huge cavalry engagement on that side. While the rest of the army marches into battle. But they've been stopped by the cavalry 
of the uh, Arabian Camel Spearmen. Very, very cool. The Desert Cavalry is going to win out. And as you can see, missiles raining down on this side of the battlefield. The elephants in the action fighting those Camel Spearmen. The big boys of the battlefield on that side. But around this flank, you can see the cavalry battle isn't going hugely well for the medium melee cavalry, the armored desert cavalry of uh, the Mercurians. The Fatimans seeming to winning out with much, much stronger Ascari Noble cavalry. In the center, it is time to meet melee. Here they go, boys. Here they go. Oh, and the NAFTA throwers there. Shredding through the African Axe Warriors. Look at those explosions go off. Fantastic to see. As the fighting continues down the front line. Here come the Nubian Palace Guard. The strongest infantry have. Fighting the pol pole axes here. The long axes. This is a brutal battle. And it will continue to be brutal. And as you can see. African Axe Warriors already running away. But the elephants are coming. The elephants are coming to sort the day out, to win the day. Look at them. Straight through, into the fight, smashing the enemy. Come on, the boys. And as we see another cavalry movement down this side of the Devit Cavalry and the Nubian Palace Guard flank. But the huge amount of Mercurian elephants that have been brought are really going to do some damage here. And here they come, straight into the back of the enemy. Straight into the back. And they rout them. Almost instantly. Ah, it was it was the Mercurians that routed, in fact, on the elephant charge. Scared of their own elephants. Maybe they know something that we don't. But as you can see, the elephants are fully in the battle now. As the uh, Nubian Palace Guard come around the flank. Ready to flank the enemy. Elephants have come out. Disengaged this side. You can see the cavil, camel archers have really finished off the cavalry. Um... So the Merc are they Mercurian Camel Archers? Sorry, that was uh, completely wrong on that one, but it doesn't really matter. The Camel Archers coming in to fight the uh, Fatimid Light Cavalry. That's going to be a good fight for them because camels are good against horses, however slow they may be. The Fatimid Long, long Axe is really reduced here, very reduced in their fight. And you can see the Fatimid Heavy Infantry and Long Axe is still fighting the Nubian Palace Guard over this side. But the full center has pretty much crumbled for both sides as the NAFTA throwers still remain throwing their NAFTA into the enemy. You can see the Royal Fatimid Cavalry in the middle fighting uh, the uh, Nubian Palace Guard. The elephants, they have lasted this long. But some of them have decided that it's time. Too many, but these African elephants, they are going to fight as these African war elephants do as well fighting the archers trying to chase them off probably not the best option to chase off but they uh, will do some damage nonetheless the cavalry fight down this side the camel archers are fighting well against the Fatimid light cavalry decent massive cavalry engagement on this side but you can see their lack of experience and low tier of unit means that they're going to be routing as well and here come the elephants. Glorious charge of the elephants. Here they come. Ready to fight. Charging in. Come on, charge, boys. Charge. Ah, oh, and you can see them absolutely smashing through the light archers. Doing some serious damage. Not happy. Oh, just destroying them. Poor light archers. Not able to put up too much resistance over here. But you can see the Fatimid general... Uh, Gloriously carrying on. Gloriously fighting onward. Um, doing a very good job of that. But the Nubian Palace Guard are here holding them back. But the Desert Cavalry is going to come in and surround them. Routing the general of the Fatimids. Like the rest of his army, he has routed. Like the fool he is. And all that is left now are a few archer units. Ready for the elephants, but some of the elephants, they've had enough. They've taken too much of a beating today. But the Mercurians are running wild now. Running wild, chasing down the routing units of the enemy. And the elephants are charging once again. A fantastic victory. Will be at hand soon.
will be at hand soon. Do not worry about it. But the African war elephants, they just need to catch up. These, these archers are pretty fast. But they don't even need to touch them. They're too scared. And here comes the final desert cavalry charging through the archers at the end. A glorious victory then for the Mercurians at the pyramids. Where they have vanquished the Fatimids. What a fantastic battle, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. A gloriously vicious and fast battle. The front line kind of got obliterated early on. Probably most likely by the elephants. You can see the elephants that took a lot of damage there. But really did the damage as well. Huge cavalry fights over on this flank. Pretty much all around this flank. Over here, over here. Uh, fighting through the enemy cavalry. And on across to the other flank. Where we had a lot of flanking action, especially from those noble infantry doing some really decent damage. And you can see some of the f some of the stats: 270 kills by these elephants. Fantastic to see the um, palace guard doing doing pretty decently. Desert cavalry doing amazing as well: 181. The camel archers pretty much worthless on their side. The Fatimid light cavalry doing a really good job. General doing a good job. Pole, the long axes really doing well as well. And you can see, fantastic. What a great battle, guys. I hope you really enjoyed that. But stick around because there is an outro as well. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Please do like, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help the channel out. And hopefully, I'll see you again in the next video after the outro. We have vanquished them. <laughs> Those fools! Georgios was right. They're so young and green, they've never faced the might of our elephants before, and it showed. Leave the bodies to the sandsmen. There is no time to waste. Pursue them, and soon Mercuria will cement itself as the greatest Christian kingdom this side of the Mediterranean. A great victory, then, for Mercuria and for Almighty God.